8 o'clock at night, it's not quite dark yet, but we have rain. We'll just say hello to Dave while we can. And we've been busy packing, Carol's going away for a week um, after the wedding, so we're going to the wedding tomorrow, and then Carol's going away for just over a week. So I've just been helping her sort her stuff out, pack her case and everything. Um, we're both still full up from lunch, so I'm not actually going to physically cook a dinner today. So if I'm a bit hungry later, I'll probably have a bowl of cereals, because that will do me. Um, and just waiting to see the foxes who comes first. I wonder if Jimmy will be first, as he normally is. But we'll see. Anyway, I'll be back when we see a fox. Well, it's 9.30 and there has been no sign of anybody, so just a bit weird. Jimmy's usually here way before now, so it's always concerning when they're late or they don't turn up. Slightly drizzling with rain, but nothing to write home about. So yeah, I'm just a bit concerned as to why he hasn't turned up yet, because that's very unlike him. Anyway, I'm sitting and I'm waiting. Jimmy has arrived. He did come a little while ago, but there was a motorbike or something and it just frightened him off and he belted, just ran for it, didn't he, mate? Yeah, it was a very noisy motorbike as well. It stopped raining, which is good. He does look rather wet. Where have you been anyway? It's late. You're never normally this late and I was getting worried. I was. Listen to me, tomorrow night and the next night, the food will be out on the ground for you, okay? And it's okay if you come a bit later, because it's not gonna go out till about nine o'clock. Come on, it's okay. Jim. Boy. They're so very wary, aren't they? Which is a good thing. It's a shame they have to be. Well done, mate. Well done. Right, you want some of this? There's one. There's two. Do you want to go for three tonight? Yeah? Do you want three? Do you want this third one? Or are you going to take two? I'm just going to take the two. Obviously somebody's coming because he's belted off down the road. Okay, there we go, folks. That was Jimmy. Late, but at least he's turned up. That's the main thing. I, I'm not going to worry myself now. Right, I don't know if that was Pip just run over the road, but Cookie's here. Here, yeah, mate. Cookie. Yeah. It's 18 minutes past 10 or thereabouts. But it was a minute ago, so maybe it's about 20 past 10. But it's been a really funny night. There's been hardly anybody here. Good boy. 
Oh, I have the second one. You need to eat that one because it's got your medication in it. Yes, good boy. Okay, so Cookie has had three days of antibiotics now. Well, happy. Aren't we, mate? Are we happy? Did we pick this one up as well? I picked that first one up. I don't know why you didn't take that. Good boy. Chicken? Chicken? That's what I say, old chicken. You're a bit wet as well, aren't you? Oh, did that bit get stuck? So I was just looking, sorry, I was just looking at your fur. I want to see if them little sore spots are healing a bit. I can't see any, so maybe this is working well. Here then, have a plate. Have a plate, mate. Now listen to me, I'm not going to be here for two nights, but there will be food out. So if you want to get the good stuff, you need to come early, okay? But there will be enough food for all of you. Just hope nobody's greedy and takes all of it. Yeah, I'll put that on there. seeing any sore spots on him now so that's good yeah that's Pip out there don't start I think that's Pip it could be Jimmy actually we've got a bit of a standoff going on here now actually that's Jimmy I think Right, what are we doing, you two? Is it Jimmy or is it Pip? I can't quite see. So it's usually Pip and Cookie that go at it together. And neither of them are moving. Here, take some chicken. I'm going to give you a couple of bits. I'm going to chuck a couple of bits out there. No, Pip, it's not. I'm sure it's Pip. I don't know, it could be Jimmy. Right, you take your chicken, mate. both in you waiting for a third one are you hold on yeah all right you got three Not sure what you're going to do, do you, mate? Hey, don't quite know what's going to go on there. They can't fight over the chicken because they've got some each now. So Cookie's dumped the three pieces and he's going to take the other two now. You can't get five in your mouth, I don't think. No, look, he's going to stash them there. I 
Can't see if that's Pip or Jimmy. Yeah, look, so we've got five pieces of chicken down there. Oh no, four pieces, because there's another piece over. Right, whoever that is has gone. Right, mate, take your chicken. Go on. Good boy. Cookie. Take your chicken. Get your chicken. Don't aggravate him. That's what you're trying to do, aren't you, I think? So that was just a piece of card or something rolling up the road in the wind. Three in his mouth at the moment. There he's got four. Right, and off he goes. Okay, so he's gone. But no sign of Pip or Jimmy, whoever it was. So I'll sit and wait and see if whoever the other one was comes back. Come on. Right, Pip has run past. I'm saying it's Pip. It could be Jimmy because I can't see him until they get a bit closer. Come on. I think it might be Jimmy. No, it's Pip. Right, Pip. Come on. Come on, mate. I'm just throwing a load of food out there for you. Do you want this? Oops, sorry. Come on. Pip. Good boy. Yeah, I was just putting the food out and he did run from the left over to the right and I thought, oh, he's going to go and find Cookie, but I think Cookie's long gone, so I think somebody may be coming, so... Right, he's done a run now. Yeah, somebody on an electric scooter went past, so he has done a runner. So hopefully he'll come back shortly and carry on. There's still food out there. I'll put a few more pieces of chicken out as well. So if he should come back, I'll catch it on the bottom camera unless I can get out to him. So Jimmy's back again. Come on then, Jim. Jimmy. You're going to eat some of that first, are you? Okay, fair enough. Fill your boots, young man.
just looking to see if what he was looking at, but there's nothing. You do like your sandwich, don't you? Should we try something here? Do you want this? Here. Do you want this? No, he says you're alright. Okay, there we go, folks. That's Jimmy. Go on, cock your leg. I knew you were going to, even though you didn't do anything. Just look watching out because Pip... Pip is being a bit of a pain tonight. He just seems to appear when any of the other foxes appear. So Pip is the one trying to show the dominance out of them all. No, he hasn't run after Jimmy there. So, okay, there we go, folks. Well, that was Jimmy. It's just gone 11 o'clock. And so far tonight we have seen Jimmy, Cookie. Sorry, I'm just watching a guy over the road. So we've so far we've seen Jimmy, Cookie and Pip seen there's been no sign of chip chip daphne ringo or howie yeah i would like to have seen howie to have got some more uh, mange medication in him but if he doesn't turn up there isn't a lot i can do about that but at least he's had that one lot which should say start the process working and hopefully he'll start improving and his fur will come back again um i'm going to give it another roughly half an hour as i do need to go to bed as I need to be up early as I've got my road trip tomorrow. So I'm going to say good night now. Um, and I will see you briefly tomorrow. But there'll be no fox footage for a couple of days. So anyway, good night and God bless. My nan used to say that all the time. My grandma hated it, but my nana used to say it all the time, bless her. Okay, so good night and I will see you all very, very soon. I'm just coming back on to say a fox just turned up. I thought initially it was Daphne, but it wasn't as skittish as Daphne. Looks very similar to Daphne, but doesn't have the big eyes like Daphne. So it seems to be a completely different fox. Unless Daphne's eyes have got smaller. I don't know what to think here. So do we have a new fox or don't we? This is the question.